This week, we are in Jasper National Park, camping at Whistler Campground within the park. It is the first week of June 2024. This is a great facility with a variety of hookups to cater to all types of campers. We are in a full hookup section 55. From our campground, we could view Jasper Tramway. Our section had patches of trees, so we had a nice view of the horizon 360 degrees around our campsite. It made for some awesome views at sunset. Each night, the elk would graze close to the trailers. It was birthing season, so we did see baby elk in the campground. The first morning we had tickets to ride up the tram. At the top of Whistler Mountain, it gave us a nice view of the campground and the valley below. We were able to zoom in on our campground and find our trailer. Nice views from the top. In the afternoon, we were able to drive out to Malign Lake. It's a beautiful views along the way, wildlife along the road. The bald eagle nest was within view of the road. I think I saw two little fuzzy heads pop up. We saw a black bear along the lake and another herd of bighorn sheep along the road. The sheep crave the salt on the road from the winter months. Next day, we drove to Athabasca Falls on the Ifields Parkway. Great views all around us. The falls is an easy walk from the parking lot. The walkway around the falls allowed for some nice photo opportunities. Close to the campground were two beautiful lakes, Lake Annette and Lake Edith. Nice maintained trails, the lakes had nice picnic areas, and it had nice views of the peaks around the area. Along the drive to the lake, we were able to see more wildlife. We saw several small groups of bighorn sheep on the trail. The sun did not set till after 10 p.m. during the, this time of the year. The mountainous landscape made for some beautiful sunsets with the western sunset hitting off the mountains. Every evening you could guarantee the elk grazing through the campground. Beautiful sights. One day, Terry and I headed down the Icefields Parkway to the Columbia Icefield. There are six major glaciers that make up the Icefield. The Athabasca, the Castle Guard, Columbia, Dome, Strutfield, and the Saskatchewan. The Columbia Icefield is the largest icefield in North America, south of the Arctic. The interesting fact is that the Dome Glacier has three flows to three different oceans, one to the Atlantic, one to the Pacific, and one to the Arctic Ocean. 
we visited the skywalk which is a glass floored skywalk suspended 918 feet in the air The day before we left, I wanted to go back to the bald eagle nest and I was able to take a photo of two baby bald eagles in the nest being fed by their mother. When we travel around, we always have our camera in the front seat as you never know what wildlife you come upon. It paid off as we were able to capture a picture of a young grizzly bear grazing in the middle. As we depart Jasper, it's been a great time. We're uh, taking the uh, Iceville Parkway. This road between Banff and Jasper is considered one of the most scenic road trips in the world. We start our journey back to Texas. Thanks for watching and you guys have a wonderful day.